everyone, my name is Derby and today I'm going to show you guys how the painting works in Junkyard Simulator. Um, it took me a while to figure it out, so I figured a little how-to video would probably be helpful for those of you who will struggle trying to figure out how the painting works in the game. Um, once you figure it out, it's really easy, really simple, and um, it's uh, a really fun aspect in this game. And um, I, it's actually my favorite part of the game now. So. Uh, without further ado, if you guys are new here, make sure to subscribe. If you find this helpful, make, um, go ahead and hit the like button. If there's something you do different, let me know down in the, the comment section. And uh, let's jump right in. Alright, the first thing on the agenda is to complete Quest 5. Quest 5 is where you restore your first car. And your first car gets taken to the hangar. So that's why we need to complete Quest 5. It's because it opens up the hangar. Um, the game puts you into the hangar showing you off all the cool cars you can upgrade and restore. Um, the only car you really start off with is the blue one. And the blue one is really easy to find throughout the map. Um, it's usually hidden a under a bunch of debris and you just delete the Wow, I can't talk, <laughs> but you just delete the debris and um, and then you can transport it back to your workshop, you can restore it and sell it, and you can keep restoring and reselling those cars over and over again. The hard part of this game is finding the other cars. Um, so you have to first find the blueprint of the other cars, which can be found in multiple locations. I found one blueprint at the motel, and then the second second blueprint that I found was in containers. So you can find blueprints for cars in containers and then um, scattered throughout the map. All right, and your next step is to puzzle piece your cars together. So you actually have to find the fenders, the hood, the trunk, and uh, the doors for your cars. Uh, they are scattered throughout the map. I found most of my pieces of my cars in the junkyard. Um, the junkyard that is the furthest right on the map. And um, you just kind of look around and you'll find them. And next to each piece, it'll say painting. So these are the pieces that go on the cars that you find. Um, for uh, your blueprints. Uh, the blueprints show up in a very specific area. It actually took me a really long time to find out where it was and it's actually behind your warehouse and garages that are behind your warehouse um, by Felix. So uh, once they are there the pieces will show up, the blueprint will show up and then you just piece your car together and then you can move it on to paint. And you paint your car in your workshop where the lifts are. So you just go up to the computer, press E, and then you say paint your car. It brings your car out on the lift, and then you do the whole renovation process on this car like you do the blue car. So you use your brush, you use the sandblaster, and then you paint it, and um, you're good to go. Once the car is fully finished, um, you can move it to your hangar where you can either keep it or sell it. Either way, you got a brand new car in your hangar. I personally am trying to collect each one of the cars and um, and uh, like have a little collection. So if you guys found this video helpful, uh, please make sure to hit the like button. Um, if you guys want to see more how-to videos, go ahead and subscribe as well. My name is Derby. I appreciate you all being here and thanks for the love. I'll see you all next time.